Minnesota Lynx head coach Cheryl Reeve didn't hold back after her team's 67-62 overtime loss to the New York Liberty in Game 5 of the 2024 WNBA Finals. Reeve expressed her frustration with the officiating, claiming it cost her team the championship. The game's turning point came with 5.2 seconds left in regulation. A foul was called on Lynx center Alana Smith, sending New York's Brianna Stewart, the 2023 WNBA MVP, to the free throw line. Stewart, who had missed two key free throws earlier, made both to tie the game, forcing overtime. The Lynx challenged the call, but it was upheld. Reeve was adamant that the foul call was the wrong decision, suggesting that a third party should be involved in reviewing challenges. All the headlines will say, Reeve cries foul. Bring it on. This championship was stolen from us, Reeve said after the game, voicing her anger. She explained that, in her view, if the situation had been reversed, the call wouldn't have been made against the Liberty. Reeve also criticized the overall officiating throughout the game, pointing out a stark free throw disparity between the two teams. The Liberty shot 25 free throws, while the Lynx had only eight. Minnesota superstar Nafisa Collier, despite scoring 22 points, didn't attempt a single free throw in the game, which Reeve found baffling. I don't understand how a star player like Fee can go to the basket, get hit, and not get a single call, Reeves said. Meanwhile, a marginal call sends Stewart to the line, and that decided the game. Collier, who fouled out in overtime, acknowledged the physicality of the Liberty's defense, stating, I was getting held a bit, and it made things tough. This loss brought back painful memories for Reeve, who compared it to the Lynx's 2016 finals loss, which she also attributed to officiating errors. This is for a championship. Let the teams decide the outcome, Reeves said. What's legal contact should be the same for both teams. It's not that hard. Liberty coach Sandy Brondello had a different take, defending the officials. I thought they were pretty fair, Brondello said. Both teams had moments where things could have gone either way, but we found a way to win. The contentious nature of the officiating added an extra layer of drama to an already intense finals series, with three of the five games decided by just a few points. Despite the disappointment, Reeve praised her team for playing within the rules and fighting to the end, reflecting on the Liberty's first-ever championship win, Reeve offered a backhanded congratulations, congrats to them. It took them 28 years. We were that close to our fifth title. Just didn't happen.